Question number one. For each sequence, find the next four terms. Number one. One, two, four, seven, eleven, and so on. Here, T one is equal to one. T two is equal to two. T three is equal to four. T four is equal to seven. T five is equal to eleven, and so on. Therefore, T one is equal to one. T two is equal to T one plus one. T three is equal to T two plus two. T four is equal to T three plus three. T five is equal to T four plus four. Using this relation, let us find the next four terms. Therefore, T six is equal to T five plus five. Is equal to eleven plus five, which is equal to sixteen. Similarly, T seven is equal to T six plus six. Is equal to sixteen plus six, which is equal to twenty two. T eight is equal to T seven plus seven. Is equal to twenty two plus seven, which is equal to twenty nine. And T nine is equal to T eight plus eight, which is equal to twenty nine plus eight, is equal to thirty seven. Therefore, the next four terms are sixteen, twenty two, twenty nine, and thirty seven. For each sequence, find. The next four terms: one upon two, one upon six, one upon eighteen, one upon fifty-four, and so on. Here, T one is equal to one upon two, T two is equal to one upon six, T three is equal to one upon eighteen, and T four is equal to one upon fifty-four. If you observe all these terms carefully, you will notice that T two is equal to T one into one upon three. T three is equal to T two into one upon three, and T four is equal to T three into one upon three. Using the same relation, we can find the next four terms. Therefore, T five is equal to T four into one upon three is equal to one upon fifty four into one upon three, which is equal to one upon one hundred and sixty two. T six is equal to T five into one upon three is equal to one upon one hundred and sixty two into one upon three. Which is equal to one upon four hundred and eighty-six. T seven is equal to T six into one upon three. Is equal to one upon four hundred and eighty-six into one upon three. Which is equal to one upon. One thousand four hundred and fifty-eight, and T eight is equal to T seven into one upon three. Is equal to one upon one thousand four hundred and fifty-eight into one upon three, which is equal to one upon four thousand three hundred and seventy-four. Therefore, the next four terms are. One upon one hundred and sixty-two, 
वन अपॉन फोर हंड्रेड एंड एटी सिक्स वन अपॉन वन थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी एट एंड वन अपॉन फोर थाउजेंड थ्री हंड्रेड एंड सेवेंटी फोर find the first five terms of the following sequences whose nth terms are given tn is equal to n cube here it's given that tn is equal to n cube for n is equal to 1 t1 is equal to 1 cube which is equal to 1 For n is equal to two, t two is equal to two cube, which is equal to eight. For n is equal to three, t three is equal to three cube, which is equal to twenty seven. For n is equal to four. T four is equal to four cube, which is equal to sixty four. For n is equal to five, T five is equal to five cube, which is equal to one hundred and twenty five. Thus, the first five terms of the sequence are one, eight, twenty seven, sixty four. And one hundred and twenty-five. Find T eleven in the following arithmetic progression: four, nine, fourteen, and so on. Solution: In the given AP, four, nine, fourteen, and so on. First term a is equal to four, and common difference d is equal to nine minus four is equal to five. We know that t n is equal to a plus n minus one into d. For n is equal to eleven, and substituting the values of a and d we get t11 is equal to 4 plus 11 minus 1 into 5 therefore t11 is equal to 4 plus 10 into 5 therefore t11 is equal to 4 plus 50 therefore t11 is equal to 54 Find the sum of first eleven positive numbers, which are multiples of six. Solution: First eleven positive numbers, which are multiples of six, are six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four, and so on, up to sixty-six. Here a is equal to six, b is equal to six, n is equal to eleven, and the last term l is equal to sixty-six. Therefore, as n is equal to n upon two into in bracket a plus l. Now, substituting the values. We have f eleven is equal to eleven upon two into six plus sixty six. Therefore, f eleven is equal to eleven upon two into seventy two. Therefore, f eleven is equal to eleven into thirty six, which is equal to three hundred and ninety six. Therefore. 
the sum of first 11 positive numbers which are multiples of 6 is 396. Find the first five terms of the following sequences whose nth terms are given. Tn is equal to n plus 2. Here it is given that Tn is equal to n plus 2. For n is equal to 1, T1 is equal to 1 plus 2 is equal to 3. For n is equal to 2, t2 is equal to 2 plus 2 is equal to 4. For n is equal to 3, t3 is equal to 3 plus 2 is equal to 5. For n is equal to 4, t4 is equal to 4 plus 2 is equal to and for n is equal to 5, t5 is equal to 5 plus 2 is equal to 7. Thus, the first 5 terms of the sequence are 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. Which of the following list of numbers are arithmetic progression? Justify. 1, 3, 6, 10 and so on. Solution. Here, 3 minus 1 is equal to 2. That is, T2 minus T1 is equal to 2. Similarly, 6 minus 3 is equal to 3. That is, T3 minus T2 is equal to 3. And 10 minus 6 is equal to 4. That is, T4 minus T3 is equal to 4. Here, we can see that T2 minus T1 is not equal to T3 minus T2, which is further not equal to T4 minus T3. This shows that the difference between any two consecutive terms is not constant. Hence, the given sequence is not an arithmetic progression. Find the 18th term of the arithmetic progression 1, 7, 13, 19 and so on. Solution Here we have T1 is equal to A which is equal to 1. And T2 is equal to 7. T3 is equal to 13 and T4 is equal to 19. Therefore, D will be equal to T2 minus T1 is equal to 7 minus 1 which is equal to 6. As we know that Tn is equal to A plus N minus 1 into D. The 18th term that is T18 is equal to 1 plus in bracket 18 minus 1 into 6. 
is equal to 1 plus 17 into 6 is equal to 1 plus 102 which is equal to 103. Therefore, the 18th term is 103. 